The second floor of Cal Poly's graphic arts building is home to what some call the weirdest bathroom on campus. The giant sink, powdered soap, and a single stall inside a seemingly single stall bathroom has puzzled many people over the years, even garnering the attention of the Instagram account Cal Poly Bathrooms. While some admire the facility's quirks, others call it a waste of space. It's awkward that there's one stall in there and I never know if I'm supposed to lock the door to get in or the stall. The mysterious restroom has left many with the question, why does it look like that? According to the original blueprints for the building, the bathroom used to be attached to a men's locker room. The basin was meant as a hands-free way to wash ink off hands so that it wouldn't get on the faucet. The building was built in, in the late 50s, early 60s, and it was the printing engineering school at the actual time. And, uh, and so it was predominantly men, predominantly white men, who uh, were part of this program. And so they had to build a space over there that was a shower uh, for the men. And the reason for that is that we had linotype machines and we had letterpress machines and we had all kinds of binder equipment and ink labs. So they would get, you know, dirty. The bathroom's appearance is in part the result of several attempts to expand the capacity of the building over the years. Offices now fill the space that used to contain showers. As for the dry soap, Macro says that borax was used because it was cheap, easy to refill, and was strong enough to break down the ink. And regarding the sticker... We were having a discussion with, with some graduates, and somehow the wash basin came up, and they're like, what's that? Oh, I... I, I thought that was a urinal. And so then everybody gasped. So we were like, we immediately have to put a sticker or something on. So we had a student do it. And I think they put on there, don't even, don't even think about it. For Mustang News, I'm Jessica Karp.